instead of having these one-size-fits-all medical treatments, all types of treatments are going to start to be personalized. One important problem that we addressed was in epilepsy. It turns out that about 15 or more percent of children that have epilepsy cannot be treated effectively with the current drugs they use. And so their only recourse for normal life is really a surgical one. But because of the differences in the geometry of a real head and a sphere and a real brain and a sphere, instead of taking out, say, pea sizes of tissue that might be corresponding to the seizure, we would have to take out much, much larger golf ball or larger sets of tissue. As the computing has gotten more sophisticated and faster and our algorithms have gotten better, we build patient-specific, high-resolution computer models of that patient's head and brain. We then take EEG electrode readings. We then map those onto our computer model and use that data to then go and, as accurately as possible, resolve where the focus of that epileptic seizure is. And that requires high-performance computing, high-performance imaging, high-performance visualization to be able to do that.